Hey y'all, welcome to my channel or welcome back. If you are new here, thank you so much for joining us. If you are returning, you already know it. <laughs> you are fabulous. All right, so today's video, guys, this is episode 178 of our 365 day daily devotionals. This daily devotional is called Jesus Calling. It is by Sarah Young and it's absolutely fantastic. It is hands down the best devotional I've ever done. It's the first devotional I've ever kept up with. So it's very, very good. Anyways, if you've missed any of the previous episodes and you would like to check that out, there is a playlist in the description box. And I guess that's it. So let's jump right in. Okay, number 178. Hmm. Stay calmly conscious of me today, no matter what. Remember that I go before you as well as with you into the day. Nothing takes me by surprise. I will not allow circumstances to overwhelm you so long as you look to me. I will help you cope with whatever the moment presents. Collaborating with me brings blessings that far outweigh all your troubles. Awareness of my presence contains joy that can endure all eventualities. Short and sweet. <laughs> that was, that's literally all of it today. That is so, so good. Stay calmly conscious of me today, no matter what. Mm. It's not always easy to do, guys, because we get so busy and life does get overwhelming and we forget we're human. It's part of it. But the second that you do think of it like, oh, oh my gosh, I need to take this to the Lord. Stop what you're doing and take it to the Lord right then. It matters. It will help you. I promise you that. It will make such a difference in your life if you take your life to God and say, here it is. Do with it what you will. I pray that your will would be done, Lord. Your life will change. Mm. So, so good. Nothing takes me by surprise. I will not allow circumstances to overwhelm you so long as you look to me. That didn't say I will not allow circumstances to happen to you. It said I will not allow those circumstances to overwhelm you so long as you look to to me. So whatever you're dealing with, whatever's going on, whatever's overwhelming you, take it to God. Give it to him. Leave it at his feet. Mm. So, so good. Collaborating with me brings blessings that far outweigh all your troubles. Praise God. I know this one for a fact. This sentence is absolutely true. Mm. Awareness of my presence contains joy that can endure all eventualities. God places a joy in your heart and in your mind that is not, it's like nothing else. It's a calmness. It's a consistent knowing that God's there and that he's going to take care of you no matter what. For me, it's, it's, it's like security, that knowledge. I need that. That is the one thing in my life that never changes, and it's God. I can't control the things going on around me. I've learned that. I can't control the weather. I can't control the day. I can't control other people. It just is not, life does not work that way. So when you feel like things are out of control and you just cannot grasp, Grab on to God. He will help you. Mm. 
He'll place a joy in your heart like nothing you've ever known before. Mm, man, so, so good. Okay, let's do um, the verses. Oh, very good verse. Okay. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in the paths of righteousness for his namesake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. Mm, praise God. Psalms 23, 1 through 4. Let me read the last part of that one more time. Just please, please listen carefully. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. God's there to comfort you to console you, to love you, to coddle you. Not to condemn you or judge you. God loves you. No matter what. Mm. So, so good. Okay. Therefore, we do not lose heart. Though outwardly we are wasting away, yet inwardly we are being renewed day by day. For our light and momentary troubles are achieving for us an eternal glory that far outweighs them all. Praise God. 2 Corinthians 4, 16 and 17. The Lord is my strength and my shield. My heart trusts in him and I am helped. My heart leaps for joy and I will give thanks to him in song. Psalms 28 seven. Mm. So, so good. Stay calmly conscious of me today, no matter what. Mm. That's my challenge for you today. Stay conscious of God. Know that he's there with you. You don't have to do it by yourself. It's not about you. It's never been about you or what you could do. It is all about what God can do and what God can do through you. So give it to God. Leave it at his feet. And praise him. Praise him for the blessings in your life. Be thankful for the very breath in your lungs. God will help you. I promise you that. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. If you have enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. It definitely helps my channel. Don't forget to share it with your friends and family and subscribe. That would be awesome. Plus hit that notification bell so that you will know each time I upload a new video. All right. Thank you all so, so much for being with me today. And don't forget, I challenge you. I absolutely challenge you today to stay calmly conscious of God, no matter what. All right. Y'all have a blessed day.